I know you probably can't see these, but I'm just putting them into your text so that I know where to find them. Here is the unit. It has a two-car garage. It's really cute. It's on a corner. Looks like it has a yard. This is going to be interesting to see on the inside. Okay, I'm going in. Okay, so I'm in a little screened area by the front door. And I wanted to show you that there are hurricane shutters around the door and all the windows. So that's a good thing. The tile's a little bit dated, but it looks like it's in really good condition. So when you walk in, you've got a nice big living area. This is what I wanted to see. These are expensive, these Hunter Douglas blinds. Woo, nice. Oh, look how cute this is. So it's got like a whole courtyard area. I'll try to get the door open in a minute. And then it's got another little area with a private yard. Okay, so let's start. Let me slow, slow down and go back to the front entry. So from the entry, you see that you can go either toward the living room or to the left toward the kitchen. The kitchen has solid surface counters. It's got a double sink. It's very spacious. Microwave, side-by-side -side refrigerator, and they have uh, put in some very expensive shutters. The garage is off the kitchen, and it's really a very nice size, oversized garage. Water um, heater is out here and it looks very dated. That needs to be replaced pretty soon. All right, so from the living room, you have dining room and living room and lanai. I'm on the lanai, they have put in, I think these are vinyl. No, they're glass. They put in um, glass like window blinds, windows and shutters, I mean. And then there's also another complete enclosure to this area. The koi pond needs a little work. <laughs> it looks a little nasty. I think you got some tadpoles in there. But look how lovely this space is and it's completely fenced in. have some fun with that koi pond. All right. Oops. So from the living room, you go into a hallway that has a bedroom on either side. I think the one at the back of the home that also opens onto the lanai is the master. <coughs> Excuse me, that's the lanai we were just on. I'm actually on the bed wall looking around as if I were lounging around in bed. So it's got a got master bathroom to the right and a big, huge closet to the left. Let's get some lights on take a closer look. All right, so typical is all I can say. This would look a lot What I started to say when I got a phone call and had to stop the tape is these would look a lot better if they were clear or if it was a better quality shower door, this whole room would look better. That wouldn't cost too much. And then this is the giant closet Looking for a light. It's really big. All right. Headed down the hall. Let's see what we got. 
We have a coat closet here for guests, which is right off of the living room. And then we have a linen closet here, right off the guest bath. And the guest bath has the same kind of finishes, and but it, it has a, a pocket door for so you can close off the shower potty area. All right, so I am leaving the guest bathroom, and I haven't looked here, but I'm guessing it's washer dryer in the hall by a ginormous guest bedroom. Look how big this is. So, these are pergo floors. Those are expensive. And that's it. It's all very private due to the way they have screened in this whole area. It's beautiful. Nice, nice window coverings, really expensive ones.